And diving back championships concluded earlier this month and one rocket ended up with a time that now stands alone and she did so in the final meet of her career. Uh, I just gave it my all. I touched the wall and I looked up and I knew right away that it was a team record. 53.46 seconds, a time Lauren Kilgore had been chasing and one that made a final splash. It was just kind of a good like closure moment, like knowing that my name would be able to go on the record board as I'm leaving. The fifth year Toledo swimmer broke the program's 100 yard butterfly mark that previously stood since 2012. Butterfly is definitely really hard on your shoulders, really hard on your upper body. You have to keep your hips up so you don't sink. Along with capping her career with history, Kilgore also submerged herself with a second team All-Max selection for the second consecutive season. I just hope that uh, I left an impact on the team, that the girls will remember me and remember um, the energy I had on the deck and the positivity that I brought to them. On Monday, UT decided to part ways with head coach Bree Globig, a mentor that helped shape this rocket speedster. Her and I have been here uh, same amount of time and I'm very grateful for her. Um, but I've had amazing coaches throughout my entire career that I give credit to. With swimming now over, Kilgore's focus shifts to pharmacy school, where she plans to earn a doctor degree next year and begin making waves in new waters. It's been a part of my life uh, since I can remember and without swimming it's going to be a big adjustment.